Oh, but it's a second poor clearance. Milosnic with Henry Hoare, surely. And the mistake from the young goalkeeper and Brisbane Raw, merciless in putting that one away. One touch on the penalty spot from Henry Hoare and the opening goal. And now Zabala's cross in. Waddingham this time gets his goal. A first ever senior goal with Brisbane Raw for the scholarship player Tom Waddingham. Or perhaps Brisbane from taking it beyond them. And just a minute after Sydney United could have been back in the contest, Nikolai Miliuznic has made it 3-0 in favour of Brisbane Raw. Henry Hoare again involved. Well, it may have been intended for Waddingham. Miliuznic gets there. The cut back towards O'Shea. Parsons. Penalty. Well, Bailey Rule claims he got the ball. Ali Reza Fagan, he's not interested. Can he score here? He does so emphatically. It is now Brisbane Raw 4, Sydney United 0. We've seen the signs here this afternoon about the goals they've given away as well. And here goes Parsons looking to add another. Oh, it's a great stop. And McNichol, Quinn McNichol, at just 15 years of age, has scored his first ever goal for Brisbane Raw just minutes after coming on. What a moment for the youngster. Stick it on to the right. Just left the ball behind, but... Bombing on was Bayich, into the middle it goes. Kelly healed only as far as struck on the volley. Oh, Steven Ugargovic. A moment of inspiration against this old side. And the Phoenix are stunned into silence. And Tonis, edge of the box, rolls it across. Into the middle it goes, McLaren! Does exactly what you expect Jamie McLaren to do. The goal scorer supreme adds a second for City. And that has them in a commanding position on course to the quarterfinals. The tail in the second half has largely been the same as it was the first. Melbourne City controlling the bulk of possession and they might be about to add to the tally. McLaren strikes again. He loves playing against Wellington and he loves scoring in front of these fans. The angle to work with was tight. But when you're Jamie McLaren, it doesn't really matter.